In this video, we'll look at your Builder Trend portal. This online portal is designed to help you and your builder communicate as well as share information, keeping you informed of job progress. Please keep in mind that your builder might not be using all of the following functions in Builder Trend, but I will highlight the possibilities. Once you've been invited to participate with your builder via email, you will be able to set up your own username and password. To log into Build a Trend, please use the login box located on your builder's website. If you do not see a login box, please navigate to buildatrend.net and enter your credentials. Once logged in, you have access to your job price summary on the left. This will show your agreed upon contract price, any change orders you may have, as well as your selection choices. Taking all of these into consideration, this will give you a running total of your job. Click View to access more detail regarding this information. Scrolling down, you can see the most recent comments, the schedule, as well as the weather report. The What's Happening dashboard displays any items that have been added that you should review. From the menu at the top, let's take a look at the schedule. Here you have access to an up-to-date schedule of where your job is and what's coming. You can communicate with your builder by selecting a schedule item and leaving a comment. This will then notify your builder and they can respond. Next, let's take a look at daily logs. Daily logs are progress reports from your builder that allow you to see site progress without needing to physically visit the site. You are able to leave comments here as well. To-dos are tasks that your builder has assigned to you you can create to-dos for yourself as well. When you have completed the to-do, you can mark it as complete, which will notify your builder that this has been taken care of. Any item that wasn't outlined in your original contract with your builder will be tracked via change orders. You can formally request a change order from your portal. Change orders that you've requested as well as change orders your builder has added to the program for you can be accessed here for your review and final approval. Selections is where you can access the different options your builder has set up for your project. You are able to see your allowances and deadlines for each choice. You can favorite choices as you go by clicking the star icon. This will allow you to reference all of your favorites at the top, giving you a breakdown of your job running total before and after if you were to approve these choices. You can approve all of your favorites here or click the approval check mark on your choices. This will allow you to approve choices one at a time. Once you sign off, the selection will have officially been approved and will notify your builder. For issues that may arise, warranty claims can be managed from within your portal. Please convey as much information in the description field as possible as it will help your builder address the issue. You can add attachments and comment on the warranty as well. Within the Files section, you're able to access documents, photos, and videos. Documents can be uploaded by selecting your specific folder. Messages allow you to easily message your builder, similar to an email. Sending messages this way will keep all correspondence in one spot for reference. Your builder may also send surveys to you and you can easily access those from your Surveys tab at the top, fill out any information, and submit it back to your builder. If you're working with a Cost Plus builder, you may be given access to job expenses as well as the budget for the job. That information can be viewed in the Bill PO and Budget tabs. Invoices can be managed directly from your portal as well. Here you are able to see past and present invoices from your builder, if your builder is set up for online payments, you'll be able to pay them through Builder Trend. From Setup, in the top right, you can edit your login information, upload a display photo for your account, enter a phone number to receive text message notifications, as well as set up accounts as guest accounts. Doing this will allow you to invite anyone to log into your homeowner portal to check in on your project. The difference between your login and the guest login is that the guest login will not have access to financial information, nor will they be able to approve anything. Their credential will be your username and whatever password you create for them. 
Homeowners utilizing the Builder Trend portal most often access information from their mobile application. You can download the Builder Trend mobile app from the App Store if using an Apple device or the Google Play Store if using an Android device. This will allow you to access everything you need right from your mobile device. Finally, if your builder is doing multiple jobs for you, you're able to toggle between the different jobs. This concludes the video, and if you have any questions or require additional support, please let our team know as we're always happy to help.